Welcome to Let's Be Foodie. Again, I'm back with healthy, delicious, easy to make recipe. Today, I will share low calorie onion crackers recipe, which is much better than store bought. So these are the required ingredients. Let's begin. Here I have taken two cups of whole wheat flour. You can also use multigrain flour. To this, I'll add salt to taste. Here goes one tablespoon of cumin seeds, two tablespoon of sesame seeds, one finely chopped green chili, some finely chopped fresh cilantro leaves, half teaspoon of baking soda, one fourth teaspoon of black pepper powder. Here I have taken dried fenugreek leaves, crush in your hand. I'll also add some onion powder around 1 teaspoon. Here goes one finely chopped red onion. I'll add one and a half tablespoon of sour cream. You can also use yogurt if you don't have sour cream. Now mix this all well. Now I'll add four tablespoon of olive oil. You can also use any other vegetable oil. Now mix with your hand. Now I'm going to knead this dough. I'll use warm water. Add little water as possible. We have to make a very tight dough. So make sure you do not add much water. So our dough is ready. Now I'm going to cover this with wet paper towel. And let this sit for about 20 minutes. It's been 20 minutes. Let's check our dough. I'll give a final knead. Now take a small portion and make a round ball and flatten. Roughly of this size. Now I'm going to roll this. I roll it as thin as possible because I want my crackers to turn really crispy. So I'm using this to cut it. You can also use cookie cutter. You can make it in any shape you like take this out using a fork I'm going to prick this so the crackers won't puff up so as you can see I've kept it very thin now on a cooking sheet I have transferred all the crackers and I'm going to bake them on 350 Fahrenheit for about 22 minutes make sure you do not over bake it I'll flip them once after 11 minutes. I've just taken them out from the oven after 22 minutes and they have turned nice light golden brown. Let this cool down and it will be super crispy. This can be also stored in an airtight container for about a week. You can enjoy this with any of your favorite toppings. Guilt free munching is ready. Share it with your loved ones. Do try this delicious recipe and let us know how it turned out for you. Put your comments below in comment section and share your experience with us. And if you like this video, give a thumbs up. Please share on social network as well. Like and subscribe today to Let's Be Foodie if you haven't yet. I will be back soon with many more delicious recipes. Until next time, bye. Refer my other videos as well for healthy and delicious recipes. If you like this video, don't forget to hit like button. You can also find Let's Be Foodie on Facebook, Google+, Twitter and Pinterest. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. It's free.